Hi, welcome back SBL student team. This is the fourth in my series of five top mistakes that candidates make in the SBL examination based on what the examiner says in feedback after feedback. And ask yourself this, have you ever walked out of an examination think you've done a really brilliant answer to a particular task only to find out later that you actually earned zero marks for it? Very often the reason for that is because you haven't actually answered the requirement of the question. The examiner says this all the time. The examiner says that candidates answered the task that they wanted or hoped to find rather than the one that was actually there. Right. So how do you avoid this? Well, the answer, and this is what I do with all of my students on the revision course, uh, and they practice it endlessly, is to use the 15 minutes reading, planning and reflection time to highlight key words in the task. All right, so that you can keep then referring back to the task to make sure that you are actually answering it. Also, going through this process forces you to think carefully about what the key words are. Yeah, is the examiner asking for an analysis of a particular approach or is the examiner asking how effective this particular approach is in the organisation being studied? That kind of detail can make all the difference between a pass and a fail.